up guys welcome back to out three garage if you coming back welcome back if you new man sub in and like this video uh stay tuned for 944 content uh really appreciate it um and thank y'all for the support and all that we had 31 subs let's keep going up but we gonna i know we're gonna grow uh steady and all that but anyway in today's video as you can see i am going to be uh installing my door panel well actually i already have it in, uh installed uh when I bought it back in February, I got two door panels and the roof liner. All those items was not in place. So I'm putting it on place, well, in place. I said on place, in place right now. Uh, the driver's side, I'm just putting the door panel in. Passenger side, probably gonna wait a little bit because we gotta put the door handle on and we're gonna put that on or whatever. Uh, we need to get the carpet and all that little straight, like vacuumed up real well, put little trim pieces back on and uh probably i think that's really it for this inside of this car it's not really too much i want to get down like i just want the trim and stuff back on just have like a little nice little bug i think i got little water leaks here and there just probably like one or two that like when it like leak in i think it's around this uh sun this 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 sun top i don't know well this you know what i mean this, this part right here the glass the panoramic uh window or whatever anyway i gotta figure that out um and i think that's pretty much it for this inside and i'm gonna just clean it all up wipe it down real good and just enjoy this car because really really i've been enjoying this car without like the trim and all that on like honestly like it's it's a car just drive it, it ain't no point in sitting. We're just sitting right now because I've been busy with ATV stuff. Um, the Mercedes been, you know, doing little videos and stuff with it, not too much. Um, and also we need to get a radiator fan, um, which I will do an install video and all that on. Um, but pretty much, guys, everything is good in this car, honestly. This car is really, this car had been running amazing. Like I took it on back roads, interstate car been running amazing. And I like the way it's pulled. I mean, it's not too big, crazy fast, but it, it got a little, you know, little juice to it. Um, but it's just a, a, the enjoyment of the car, you know, like you can't stop looking at it because the presence of the car is so beautiful. Um, but yeah, let's get into this door panel. Let me tell y'all what I had done so far. Um, getting dark on me, but let me tell y'all what I've done so far. Um, yeah, let's get into it. Like I said, sub in, like, and thank y'all. Really support, uh, really thankful, man. Can't even really talk right now. Let's go. So, guys, as you can see, I got my door panel on. I had recently went to the auto parts store the other day, and I had got these, uh, trim screws, which is black. Um, got a discount on this. Every time I go to the uh, auto parts store and all that, I always get like a discount or something like that. Like my Tahoe, the battery kept dying and my warranty was up and then I ended up getting a full battery and stuff, which is crazy. Okay, so as you can see, as you can see, this is the door panel right here. I had put the trim screws in all around. Now we're gonna be missing that one part, but it's okay. It's really okay. I'm not even tripping about it. I like the door like this, honestly. I know where I can get some. I know it's the, the handle you can pull and all that, but usually it's okay. I just pull it like that. I can leave it like that. They got, at, at, they got, I can't even talk right now. They got aftermarket uh, door panels um, that kind of like similar like this, but it got like the rope that pulls and it's similar though. It don't have all the extra stuff on it, like weight reduction. Um, as you can see, I got to stretch this out. I got to really like stretch it out and then put it in like a little hole and then uh, screw it down. And then I'm going to get, I got this at the market radio set that the, <clears throat> the previous owner had gave me. The previous owner had hooked me up really well even with the papers and all that so i'm gonna put that speaker in and see how it look this piece i think it's for the mirrors and all that i probably need to find that online but in this piece right here nah. but this is the door panel for the 944 we're gonna clean it up afterwards but i need to figure out how i'm gonna get this in place so stay tuned 
So guys, I put in a, a screw over here to hold this leather in place because if not, I'm not, I literally have to use force to stretch this uh, across here. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put in a, a screw there and there. And then once that's like t nice and tight, then I'm gonna move this out, unscrew this bolt, right? I mean, unscrew this screw and then move it towards that way, screw it in and wherever that hole is, um, put in that black screw right there. And then we're gonna, like I said, we're gonna put the speaker in. But I'm gonna use utilize the trim I have already and stuff. I did. Hey guys, this is the finished product. The leather is stretched. I made sure it was stretched all the way over there to where no gold is showing. I had to put two screws right there to pin it, and one right there. I'm gonna leave it like that. It don't, it don't look bad at all, honestly. Um, but like I said. A piece need to go right here though. But like I said, I'm gonna leave it like this. Um this leather just gotta be stretched, that's all. Hopefully do it during this while it's baking in the sun, but I doubt, I'm not sure. But I had to really like stretch it. And I had to put the original screws right here. That's pretty much it though with the door panel. I'm um, finna slap in that radio speaker uh, temporarily. And like I say, I just look like a hot mess right now. Like, I like showing stuff like this. It's a hot mess and we gonna make sure it's cleaned up. Still got my bedroom shoes in. I ain't moved those like two months. Yeah, this car gotta get, I'm gonna do a cleaning for this car, so stay tuned. But anyway, let me put the speaker on. Let me, see, let me give y'all like a visual effect on how that will look, and then I'm gonna just wipe it down. Um, real. So this is the door when it's closed. Gotta get a retent. But as you can see, I forgot uh, to mention I do need some visors too. So that shouldn't be bad. Visor, um, reading light, and another visor too for the inside. We probably gonna end up doing this next. I'm gonna have to get some type of stuff like this to put on the roof. You know, but overall not bad. I think this car interior was brown. I am mistaken, it looked like it was brown. Yeah, it was brown. Yeah, it was. So it was like a brown and black. It's like a, it was a brown and black interior because it's kind of like brown up top too, yeah. But we're gonna have to clean this all up. Can't wait. See you for real, for real. Let me go get this speaker. So guys, I got the speakers right here. And then I got the radio. I'm not gonna hook up. I'm probably gonna do some research on how to do that to Sony. Um you bought that right here. This is the headliner right here. I'm gonna talk. Anyway, these are the covers right here. I know this one sound good in here. I think I'm missing a cable if I ain't mistaken. Where did I put it with that other? Nah. This cable right here. I'm gonna have to splice in the other wire right here. Yeah, I think I'm about to splice in. I probably can use the original. Probably. Probably, probably. It looks like it's at the market anyway if it had got spliced. Yeah. Anyway, I see. So guys, got the original, not original, but at the market uh, speaker in. So I'm guessing it's going to have to go like this. And what I'm guessing, I believe the screws right here go through there. But well, I'm going to have to get clips on the back side. So yeah, but it's going to fit nice though. It's going to fit up nice. 
we see, we will see, we will see, we will see though. I mean, it fits up nice. It fits up too bad. It's gotta be screwed down real good, but it's not bad. Anyway, let me just clean this door up, honestly. Give it a fresh look. We'll use some of these mothers of uh, BLR. Anyway, let that sit real quick. Well, I'll get me a cloth and I'm gonna wipe her down. And that's gonna be it. That's, like I said, stay tuned for, you know, a clean transformation in here. Uh, it's dusty, y'all. Best believe. And I don't mind showing it. I will show the real side. Best believe that. But anyway, our old school 944. Let's get her, let's get inside uh, looking good again. And that's it. Wait, it's probably like that burning. You putting way too much on there, but man, look how it came out. Beautiful. Beautiful. I can't wait to see it in the sun. And I can't wait to get like this interior like this, like just clean looking and stuff, you know? It's a Porsche, you know? Um Yeah. But if y'all enjoyed this video, um Please give a thumbs up. Uh, if not, it's understandable. I'm not tripping. I'm still gonna be dropping videos and all that. Still gonna be providing. And if you're enjoying um, the 944, uh, like I said, so sub in, like, like the video, uh, share it to your uh, friend and all that. Um, we just going one step at a time. Um, let's get these door panels in, and that's pretty much it. We got the driver's side in. We just probably need to find a trim piece. Probably do some research and uh, probably to get this little piece right there and we need to get some clips so we can screw that speaker in and uh solder the wire and all that together so we can just have this door side complete and probably this little stem right there um but that's pretty much it uh with the interior um for right now so stay tuned for more uh thank you working on through garage stay tuned for more uh really humble um i'm glad i'm starting like this honestly this is very humbling and stuff um and i could have got a probably like a brand spanking new one but it's, sometimes just fixing up something man it, it goes a long way actually putting your time and your heart into it goes a long way and this car has been really fun uh the past few times i have been driven it um, even after doing all the motor work, I got videos and stuff on that. Probably need to put them together and just drop them randomly. Um, but yeah, and I've been driving it like this, honestly, but it's, it's a project car. It's, it's going to get done. Honestly, it's going to get done. And I really appreciate it. I really do. But man, look at that brown popping out in that black. That's crazy. Bro, I bet back in the 80s, this must have been crazy, man. And I will give y'all the history and story on this car. Uh, the first time I bought it, how much and all that. Uh, I should have been did a video on that, but I will. Uh, so stay tuned, guys. Thank y'all. Oh, and the fuses. Not fuses, relays. I need you and I'm full for God. Please, please let me know. I need those relays right there that's missing. But I'm gonna uh, end up doing more research clearly and all that. As you can see, we got an element to mess us for. And we gotta put this back. I'm gonna put this back. And we just gotta get the side trim pieces. That's pretty much it, man. All right, see y'all. Don't want to talk.